Kilda, Tinegato, hello and welcome back aboard the ANS Yamato. My name is Bedros and this is my Let's Play of Star Lancer. Mission 20! We're getting very close to the end of the LP here. There are still a couple of bonus episodes that I want to do. I've started working on the very first... Well, not the... Sorry. <laughs> I've started working on a bon another bonus episode that's going to be covering exactly what it takes to make a Star Lancer episode, which should be pretty cool. Give Klaus some food. Awesome stuff. Just make sure he eats and let's head onwards. To the rest of the episode, walk over to the door and listen to the AC news and get to the mission and that's generally how these things go, aren't they? <laughs> Let's do it. This is Heidi Moore reporting for the Alliance Conflict News on November 5th, 2161. Today, reports are being received that Klaus Steiner believed killed in action is alive and has been rescued. The Flying Tigers led the operation to free Steiner, who was being held prisoner aboard a Coalition prison ship. Military sources have not commented on the condition of Steiner or details of the action, but Steiner is recuperating aboard the ANS Yamato. The news is spreading fast throughout the Alliance fleet, and Admiral Caldwell is said to have talked to Steiner personally to welcome him back from his ordeal. Also today, Alliance forces on Titan, after bitter ground fighting, have finally secured the capital Talius. The last compound captured was the Coalition's headquarters. Several high-ranking officers and officials have been captured and arrested, and all are to face war crimes charges. This is Heidi Moore for the Alliance Conflict News, signing off until next time. You're just completely skipping over the fact that there are also hundreds of other prisoners aboard the Saladin, apart from Steiner. Oh my gosh. I guess being a celebrity does have its perks Sir. in the world of Star- Hey, the world of Star Lancer. Anyway, let's head over to the briefing room and hear what Enriquez has to say about our mission today. Or to give us a mission for today. Hello, Bioscanner. Thank you for letting me in. You know, it's a little bit of a worry if you're aboard the- <laughs> aboard the Yamato. And you have to be bioscanned to get into the briefing room, I guess. Is it a thing in the military where it's like confidential? Pipe down, people. Due to the recent Alliance successes, the Coalition front line is beginning to fragment. We must seize this opportunity and hit them hard before they regroup. A convoy has been detected trying to make a run for Coalition space. Command wants us to stop it from regrouping with other enemy ships. The convoy is made up of a Class II carrier, the C.S. Ufelski, Scarab troop carriers, a Berejev command ship, and lastly, an escort of heavy fighters. Standard procedure, people. The Tigers go in first to soften up the fighters and ship defenses. Then Gamma Wing finish the job with torpedoes. Once the convoy has been destroyed, return to the Yamato. I would have also assigned the Ronin to this one, but they'll be escorting Admiral Kulov back to Alliance Command so they won't be able to join the party. Good luck out there, pilots. Well, that kind of sucks that the Ronin won't be there, but that's all good. We'll be able to take out these guys without them, I hope. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get the Phoenix out. Of course, best ship in the game, in my opinion. It's only got four hard points, though. If it had, like, five, that might be a little bit better. So what are we going to take today? As always, let's play it safe with a fuel pod. And uh, maybe a raptor or Solomon. Yeah, so the raptors are like a slightly better version in my mind. A little bit more range. Oh, no, no, the Solomons actually do a bit more damage, don't they? And how many are there? There's four in there and there's only three raptors. Okay. So I guess we'll, we'll take a Solomon then, why not? And we'll also pick up two Screamers as well. Love the Screamers. That should be pretty good, I think. Let's go ahead and exit and head towards the hangar deck. Dismissed. Mm-hmm. Hello, everybody! Okay, see ya! You clear for launch. Good luck. Control out. Roger that control. Launch me out of the tubes. It's December 8th, 2161. Tigers, Ronin Wing is launching now. All right, and Wolverine as well. Okay, let's keep this nice and simple. Good luck, Tigers. Hey, luck 
doesn't come into it. You just take care of Admiral Kula. I can assure you, he's in the safe hands. Safe journey, Commander. Off they go. Okay, Tigers, let's move out. Ready to jump out. All right then. It's hit that J key and it's time to jumpy jump. Away! <laughs> Never gets old. What's going on, everybody? Uh oh. Let's do I it. Think we're a little outnumbered, Tigers. We've got half the coalition fleet here. You're out of control. We're gonna need backup. Copy that. The Marauder should be with you any second. Now, where have I heard that before? Well, girl. This is the Marauders. Looks like you could use a hand. Have a bit of patience. Tigers, this is Marauder's wing leader. We're gonna take care of the shield generators. You take care of the fighters. Okay, engage the fighters and Kurgis first. Hit them, Tigers. Okay, now the problem with these Cossacks... No, 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 no. <laughs> let's get the screamers out, Great okay? Shot, buddy. Yeah, the problem with Cossacks is that they have extremely powerful shields. No, <laughs> As you can see, it took a long time to take out that guy. Even with popping a few screamers in there. Oh, match speed, a rudel. They could just cruise around. That armor, though. Yes. Oh, he's almost dead. <laughs> he must oh, be going no, real no. slow. Nice. Like this, folks. Oh, by the way, if you guys haven't tried it, <laughs> okay. slow down the speed. Oh, yep, never mind. Ah, uh, yeah, so if you haven't tried it yet, slow down the speed in the YouTube player. Moose sounds like he's drunk. It'd sound like, you know, requesting more beer from some bartender off screen. No, please, no. <laughs> it's kind of funny. You got him. I just noticed it one time. Yep. Nice. Brian Hardshot. Uh oh, that's a havoc. Dang it. We're vulnerable. Raise the shields. <laughs> I guess you could technically do that if you have like four hands. You could. Could erase the shields right there, but we were fine. No, Ooh. No. Taking All some way, damage. Keep it coming, buddy. No, no. <laughs> okay, how many more of these fighters are there? There are a lot of them. Oh, Mr. Riddle. There we go. Be so strong. Not Vixen! No, no. Alright, there's another Great one shot. down. Great shot! <laughs> That's the last of them. You spoke too soon. We got reinforcements coming in fast. Our oh, comrades will be avenged, Alliance Filth. Now, is that any way for a lady to talk? Hey, we should be honored. That's Katrina Ileana, the so-called Angel of Death. So equip her wings. Take out the ravens with pleasure. Wherever they are. So what are they flying lags? They're a bit easier to take out than the Cossacks, that's for sure. No, 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 no! There we go. Keep it coming, buddy. I promise you, our paths will cross again, tigers. Okay. Off oh, the go. I didn't even get her number. Walk it out. Nice work, Tigers. Uh, thanks, Bridge Officer Slash and Rikis. Tigers, Gamma is going to have to make their move now before Coalition reinforcements arrive. Try and divert some of that flak. Uh, right. Yeah. Tigers, we haven't got long. Yeah. Take out the Uvliski's rear turret first. Get to it. Oh, okay, right. Turrets on the back. Okay, now take out the rear gun on the Barajev. Hurry! Yes, sir, redoodles. Okay, okay. Go, 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 go! Okay, there's two on the back of the Berejev. I took out two on the Uffelski as well. We're starting our run. Okay, already. Things are quickie here. So let's take that out. Alright, let's take this thing out. Can we actually destroy this? Uh, we can, but it takes a while. What about the Kurgans? I don't think there are any more Kurgans. This is pretty much it. We're running out of bad lasers to fight you guys. <laughs> let's use a few Solomons. Selected. 
Well, maybe uh, we'll, well, let's go ahead and use a couple of summons. Why not? I don't really use the missiles very much. Well, you can't lock onto this, though, can you? Okay, there's another scarab. Okay, let's go take that out too. Man. Okay, I think I just heard something big got taken out by the torpedoes as well. They got the other torpedoes. I'm taking out this thing. Okay. I think, did I get it? Woo. Tigers, we've got an emergency comms from the Ronin. I'm patching it through. It's no use. They were waiting for us. Black Guard, repeat. Black Guard. Alpha 5, get a lock on their position. Come on, move it. I'm working on it. Come on, talk to me. I've got it. Two jumps from here. Get to it, Tigers. Marauders, back them up. Let's go. Okay. The Ronin got in trouble, the Black Guard are there. They, did, they, they, they busted Kulov out. Things can never seem to go to plan when you're fighting, you know, these guys. <laughs> and one jump down. Jump out. Well, let's do it again. Also, rest in peace, Vixen. You will be remembered right now. And possibly never again. Just saying. There's like nothing left, is there? Just minor debris. What have you got? We're too late. The Ronin are gone. Oh, damn it. Alpha 5, tell me you got something. Just debris. Whoa, wait. I'm picking up a comms beacon. Oh, okay. Let's see if we can uh, head towards that guy. Okay, we seem to be heading in the general right direction. Shall I speed up a little bit? I assume it's like right there. It's a little bit close. Further around the field, okay. Ah, oh, there it is. Patch it through. Fashionably late, I see, tigers. You've missed the show. It has to be said your comrades put up quite the struggle. I swear on it, Kulov. You're a dead man. Not in your lifetime. Christoph Wing, wipe them out. It will be a pleasure, Admiral. Oh, it's Petrov. And I guess another couple of... Oh. These Solomons look pretty awesome. Okay, you're blue. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Solomon, your face. Are these the ones that stay locked on even if they cloak? I think so. Okay, you kind of got to aim a bit ahead. I'm not sure if they have like a thing that they fire on. Any guys closer? Yeah, there you go. Oh no, you don't. Eh. Eh. <laughs> Where are my screamers? Still have a ton of those, so go ahead and burn through those. Okay, Petrov, the last one to go. Alright, suck it! Eat Screamer Doodle Doo! Oh! <laughs> Let me guess, he's immortal, right? Because plot? Yeah, looks like a day we would have killed him by now for shizzle. Alright! Are there any more? Yeah, there's a few more. Okay, gotta take those dudes out. Let's take this guy out. Get rid of that missile. <laughs> Alright. Oh no! Maybe! Not Mayday! Okay, there's another black guard. I guess the others were cloaked out or something when I was looking around for them. Alright. You cloaked, but you can't hide! Because we have vision! Vision Ultrons! There's another one! Holy crap, how many are there? Alright, there they go. Yeah.
Okay. That's Ready it. To jump out. We're not gonna chase them or anything, I guess not. Well, we don't have a... We can't check the coordinates. I, I, anyway. <laughs> Let's go hit him, jumpy jump. Back home. There we go, that's that music I'm familiar with. <laughs> Tigers, initiate landing procedure. Yes, sir, you've got my... Your wish is my command, even though I've been in this place, you know, longer than you have. <laughs> Go ahead and get permission, permission to land. To land. Yep. Bring her in, Stop. Ace. You clear to land. Oh, ha, ha, ha. yeah, you hear that, guys? We're an ace. <laughs> so, that was mission 20 of Starlight. So, just a kind of a bit bog standard, honestly. The only real hard part, I guess, is the very beginning where you have to deal with the Cossacks. Uh, but as long as you throw a few screamers at a couple of them, or, you know, just everyone, it, it's, you know, they're not too hard to take out. Uh, I think the Ravens are scripted to get away, and obviously Petrov scripted to get away there as well. Alright, hopefully the audio is recording this time. Uh, hopefully. <laughs> what do we get? Uh, just kind of a meh rating, whatever's. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll take it. I think we did pretty much, uh, pretty good there. But anyway, let's go ahead and read today's uh, debriefing. The destruction of our sister squadron, the Ronin, is a terrible blow to us, and they will be severely missed. The captain is understandably furious that they did not receive any warning from command of an attack group well behind our lines. Kulov's escape and the Ronin's loss have overshadowed today's victory, but we will continue. It is our duty to uphold the Ronin's name and honor. Make sure that you make the Coalition pay for their victory. Our chance will come to take down the Blackguard and Petrov. However, your flying today was excellent. The interception of the Coalition convoy will hit the Coalition hard. The destruction of the Ufelski and its support craft will severely hamper Coalition operations and deprive them of crucial troops and resources. Intelligence proved correct, and we capitalized. With the Coalition frontline units now showing signs of withdrawing and regrouping around new positions, it won't be long before we face the Coalition's second fleet. Stay alert, and let's keep it tight out there, Commander Enriquez. Fancy stuff, so we got 18 kills in that mission, bringing our overall kill count up to 376, and we didn't rank up or level up because we've hit the max level and rank! <laughs> And I think we're still rank number one, of course we are. Well, yeah, we're 110 kills above anybody else now. Steiny falling behind though, though I think he actually has got a few kills in there. Kinda sneakily. Bandit getting very close to Steiny and Dice Man kinda lagging behind a little bit there as well. <laughs> Let's see what else is going here on the killboard, Ned Dundee. Very good. <laughs> and Robert Foe. Awesome stuff. Guys, that is it for this episode of Let's Play Star Lancer. I hope that you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Kia kaha, and I'll see you in the next episode.